Joining me now is Brittany Pope, the Executive Director for the Bossier Arts Council. Thank you for joining us, Brittany. Hi, Alexandria. How are you? <laughs> I'm wonderful. How are you? Wonderful. Okay, well, we have a lot of things going on, and there's a lot of fun in store for tomorrow's event. Event. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Well, leading up to the main event, which is Artini, which will take place June the 10th, we always have glass painting parties. And it's a highlight of the process along the way. It's open to everyone to attend, while our main event is for 21 and up. You can actually bring your teenagers okay. to our glass painting parties that we have there at Bossier Arts Council in our annex building. Typically, the glasses are just laid out. We provide the paint for you. You bring your friends. Um, if you may want some charcuterie, whatever you want to do to help you paint uh, and help us get prepared along the way, you can do so. Okay, and you, you said it's for 12 and up, right? Typically 12 and up is what we recommend. Uh, that way you can spend a little time with your younger ones. And then also it gives them an opportunity to contribute to, contribute to an event um, that mom and dad may enjoy. Okay, I know it's free and there's no registration. Correct, you just show up. <laughs> We're there from 6 o'clock until 9 p.m. and it's free paint. You come in, you grab a glass, and just start painting. Again, we provide the supplies, you simply show up. And this is the first of several because we have about 600 glasses or more to get painted by June the 10th. Okay, so for that annex building, is there a limit on how many people can come? Typically, we cap off at about 50 for us to comfortably be in the space. And it is a rotation. You can come in and out. Some people kind of come, paint one or two glasses, and they leave. And then they go explore the rest of the East Bank. Okay, and you don't get to keep these glasses. These glasses are specifically <laughs> for the event on June the 10th. We ask you not to put your name on it or not to put the date um, on it. You just simply give life to the glass with your creativity. And I know you say everyone, but not everyone is uh, inclined art wise so are you going to give instruction or is this just a freestyle it's a freestyle of painting we will have a little bit of decor you'll be able to see the event art some of the event art so that way you can get your inspiration as to how you may want to decorate your glass and there is a theme there is a theme. This year's theme is titled Destination Artini and it's inspired by the art and the decor of the late 1980s, specifically in Miami. Okay, well that yes. sounds exciting, Miami Nights vibes. Yes, most definitely. <laughs> We're gonna have a good time. Awesome, and this is going to push towards the main event. Tell us a little bit about the Artini event for those who aren't familiar. Artini is the annual fundraiser for the Bossier Arts Council. It is a cocktail competition that includes some of this area's favorite restaurants and bars contending for the best cocktail. Mm. We're sponsored by various community partners and businesses here in the Arklatex. Everyone is invited, 21 up and up, of course, to purchase a ticket. Tickets are for sale now on Eventbrite only $75, but your $75 is what helps us as the Bossier Arts Council to carry out our mission throughout the year. Absolutely, and you do get to keep the glasses in, right? Now, yes, okay. everyone that <laughs> attends the event does get to keep a glass. That's why we need everyone to come out to our paint parties and paint, paint, paint away, because every guest that attends our teeny leaves with a hand-painted glass. Okay, and I know you're the executive, executive director Correct. for the Bossier Arts Council. Yes. What other things do you have going on right now? That is the primary focus. We are gearing up for summer. We're gonna have some great activities there at our building, there in the gallery. We have great activities that we put on in our plaza across the street. We're getting ready to partner with one of our neighbors, Flying Heart, to host Kegs and Corks, which will take place in May. So quite a bit coming down the pipeline. And you guys can keep up with Brittany and the Bossier Arts Council by heading on over to their Facebook page, Bossier Arts Council. Brittany, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me.